everyone. I hope you're all okay today. And if you're not feeling very well, I hope you feel better soon. It's horrible here. It's like autumn. It's wet and windy and only 16 degrees, which is ridiculous for August. Um, it's usually nice and warm, but that isn't the way it is at the moment. Had to go out shopping, but I was glad to get home in the warm. So I've got my beautiful Christopher Ross Robin with me today. I was going to change him in this lovely little romper um, for Theme Thursday, but I didn't get a chance to get back. So instead of doing that, I've been buying him some things. And as you know, I did your, the shopping video for you from Sainsbury's. They had a lot of classic poo things. And I bought him this lovely blanket, which I hope you can see. It's really nice. It's got classic poo on it. It's cream. It's classic poo and piglet and tigger. And on the other side of it, it's plain. Where is it? At the top, it's got classic poo and tigger and everybody so you can have it either side but I like this side so I put that on and someone said he shouldn't have a stiff bear he should have a poo <laughs> have a poo that sounds rude doesn't it have a Winnie the Pooh so I got him a classic Winnie the Pooh lovey so he's got that now <laughs> so I'll just take that out of the way and what else did I get him? Let me just get you back on focused on him. Um, I actually got him, because when I was on the sty fruit, I got him a little blue onesie. Um, a lovely baby blue with a little bear, little sty bear face on it. But for the classic poo things, I got him one of these onesies from Sainsbury's TU. I had to order it because they didn't have any newborn size. Um, so I'm hoping that'll be all right. It might be a bit big for him, but it's really nice. It's cream and it's got Winnie the Pooh in, on a label. And it's got the back of Winnie the Pooh, Piglet, Eeyore and Tigger. I think that's really nice. And today I'm going to put him into a little two-piece, which is classic poo. And that's a cream top with Winnie the Pooh on there. And it says, oh, Piglet Tigger, where are you? Here we are, Pooh. And they're at the bottom, look, there's Tigger and Piglet. And it's long-sleeved. And it's got a little pair of footed trousers. And it's got Winnie the Pooh and Piglet and Tigger on them. And they've even got Tigger on the feet and Pooh on the feet. So I hate you saying that. It's Pooh on the feet. It sounds rude, doesn't it? But anyway, I'm going to pop him into that and have a chat. Just take it off the hanger. Yeah, I didn't get back yesterday to you. I was hoping I could, but some days my husband, I have to keep an eye on him. He gets a bit confused sometimes. I don't know why, just our age, I suppose. And I just have to keep, you know, I don't feel comfortable leaving him doing things. So I, um, I was keeping a, an eye on him yesterday. So I didn't actually get back. It was a shame, but... Um, we're doing it today, so that's all right. He's downstairs with Chloe. Right, little Christopher Robin, let's turn you over, sweetheart. There we go. There we go, baby. You're going to look at everybody. Oh, he's just, he's fast asleep. Let's take your little top off. Yeah, um, he's downstairs looking after Chloe. There we go, sweetheart. There he is. Oh, he's such a beautiful boy, aren't you? He's a beautiful boy. Yes, you are. 
got my new dishwasher installed without any problems thank goodness I did worry in case they couldn't get the old one out because um, when my new kitchen was put in um, was before you know they put the island in the middle um, and I didn't know if there'd be enough room for them to get the dishwasher out because they put the dishwasher in before they put the island in, if you get my meaning. So I was a bit concerned in case they couldn't actually get the um, old dishwasher out, but they did. So that was brilliant. Get his little arms out. Of course, he is um, the Christopher Robin sculpt by Joanna Kazmarak. And he was actually reborn by her herself. Um, and he's got three quarter arms, as you can see, and full legs. He's absolutely beautiful, baby. He really is. So he's a partial silicone. I'm going to put this little stife onesie underneath, seeing as I bought it for him specially. Yeah, so I've got my new dishwasher and I'm really pleased because it was getting very tedious putting, you know, washing up all the time. There we go, darling. There we go, sweetheart. There we go. Where is he? Oh, there he is, sweet boy. Uh, yeah, so I was glad that all got sorted anyway. I hope you're seeing him all right. There he is. And we took Chloe to the vets to have her glands and everything done on Tuesday before she went to the groomers on Wednesday. And they found a little problem. So they're doing a test on her. So I should know more about that next week. It's a bit worrying. But, I mean, with dogs, there's always something, isn't there? Are you seeing him all right? Has he got his hand in the way? Have you got your hand up in the air so people can't see your face, baby? I think Mummy needs to give you a bit of a powder, doesn't she? I'll do that in a second. Just see if this fits him. Yes, that's a bit of a worry with Chloe, but we'll see. I mean, she's getting on now. She's nearly 11. You do get health problems with dogs as they get older, don't you? There we go, sweetie. Oh, that's not too bad. It's a bit long for him, but that's all right. It's not a problem, is it? No, that's fine. There we go. There's a good boy. <laughs> He's a sweet boy, aren't you? Yes, you are. I'm so glad I turned this little one into a boy because he does look fantastic as a boy. Right, let's get my powder. I never get everything ready, do I? Didn't know he'd need a powder today. But I think it's a good idea to give him just a little go over. So what have you all been doing? Have you all been busy? I've had... A really busy week, what with one thing and another. It's always busy when Chloe's going to the groomers and everything. That's it. Hopefully we'll have a, a quieter week next week. We seem to have weeks when we're in and out of the house a lot, you know. Of course, when it's the weather's like this, it's not good. It's horrible going down the town today. It was really um, cold and wet, you know. There we go, darling. Let's just do your arm. That's it. And your little hand. There we go. Just take the shine off of him a bit. on your face baby there we go that's better isn't it yeah there we go 
that's better just give him a little powder before I put his outfit on so let's put his little trousers on see what these look like I'm hoping they're going to fit him all right. These are newborn size. He's quite a big boy, not like my little Beatrix. Aren't you? You're a little nice size little boy. There we go. Let's get your little legs in. There, there we go. They fit nicely, don't they? Let's get your little foot in that one. It's very hard because he has these little bent legs. I do try and be very careful with them. There we go. Yeah, that's it. Let's put your little top on. Are you seeing him all right still? Oh, he's got his hand over his face again. Oh, he's terrible for doing that, aren't you? Putting your hands over your face when people want to see you. There we go. Yeah, over we go. I should have put some little mittens on, shouldn't I? Let's find a pair of socks to put over your hands just for a second. right by the sock drawer so that's handy just put some socks on his hands to get his hands through these long sleeves yeah so we've been as I said we've been quite busy this week but I've managed to do a couple of videos there we go darling let's get that hand in there we go. Little fists are so much easier to put in than splayed hands. There we go. Right, this is your little open hand. Let's get him through. There we go. There's a good boy. There's a little sweetheart. Yeah. These are really nice little, I think they're little pyjamas actually. There we go, just take this off, make sure your little hand's all right. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> Gorgeous little hands. Is this one all right? We're going to the cinema tomorrow. Oh, perfect. Yeah, going to the cinema tomorrow afternoon to see Good Boys. It's um, like a, I think it's a, a funny drama -y kind of thing about a group of little boys. A bit like Stand By Me, um, if you've seen that. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing that. And it's in our favourite screen, which is screen six. It's not on till later in the afternoon, though. So I might be able to do a video tomorrow if I'm lucky. There we go, darling. Or depending on what's happening here. There we go, darling. There, they look nice on him, don't they? <laughs> Winnie the Pooh. And let's get this little brush and give your hair a brush. Hopefully you're seeing him okay against the cream because he is very blonde. Let's get my Mother Goose brush out. Really like these little wooden brushes. They're nice. Right, should we do your hair down this time, baby? Let's put it forward, shall we? There we go. Got lovely hair, this baby, a very white blonde. There we go. Do it forward. There, real little lad, aren't you? A real little boy. There we go. And there's your Winnie the Pooh. So he's all ready for bed, isn't he? 
He's certainly fast asleep, so he's well ahead of me. So there he is. I hope you can see him okay. Let's have a little close-up of him. His little outfit and his blanket. He's such a sweet little boy, isn't he? And yeah, um, like I said, I'm hoping I might get to do a video tomorrow. Um, should have plenty of time, but I'll see how things go. And I did actually buy the Winnie the Pooh books. Someone was selling the full set of Winnie the Pooh. So that might be something I read in the future. Because I've never actually read them. So yeah. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing my gorgeous little Christopher Robin today. And we'll speak to you soon, won't we? Say bye-bye, everybody. Have a good rest of your day. <laughs> yeah, beautiful boy. Mwah. Love you, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>